Hi guys, this is Daniel from FND. In this video, we are going to see how to try XDXL 1.0 for free in online. And recently, Stable Division XL 1.0 model got released. So if you want to try that, you can try it online or you can directly download that model and use it on your uh, automatic 11.11. So if you want to try it online, you can use different methods. I'm going to show two different methods. So let's get started. So first one is using the clipdrop.co, which is the official website by stability.ai. And you already know the stability.ai uh, released XTXL 1.0. So you can try directly from this website. You can log in with your account. If you don't have, sign up. And you can generate up to 400 images for free with watermark. And also you have monthly and annual plan in that you will get 1500 images per day and also you can skip queue so let's go to clipdrop.co slash stable diffusion and enter your prompt let's add some prompt i'm gonna give astronaut taking selfie near so i'm gonna give this prompt and you can click on this filters icon and you can select different styles so you can select different styles like photographic, digital art. I'm going to select uh, cinematic. You can also select aspect ratio. So I'm going to select uh, white screen. You can also select cinematic, whatever you like. So you can also give negative prompt. If you don't want anything in your image, well, you can give that here. So let's leave it as it is. And I'm going to click on generate. So you can see for the poster, image generation you need to purchase pro i'm gonna click on skip you need to wait until these number of images so you can see the results so the results are looking good so if you don't like this you can press on plus and it will generate another four images so you can see the results so you can select anyone and you can download you can also go to edit and uh, remove background clean up imperfections also you can use a relight and you can use any different features from clip drop so if you like any one of these images you can click on that image and click on download to download so i'm gonna go back and you can see here you can also select different style let's try another style i'm gonna select anime and this time i'm gonna select the aspect ratio to nine is to 16 let's generate and click on skip and in previous xtxl 0.9 you can't select aspect ratio but in 1.0 they are given different aspect ratios so you can select different aspect ratios also in previous model in clip drop you can't add negative prompt but you can now add negative prompts as well and you can see the results so this one looks very good this one also looks good so you can select anyone from here and click on download to download these images. This is the way you can use XTXL 1.0 using clipdrop.co. And next method is using Playground AI. So go to playgroundai.com and log in with your account. Then click on create and you will get a board and canvas select board. And on the right hand side, you can see in the model section, the stable division excel model being added already we have playground version 1 1.5 uh, 2.1 and dali 2 now the stable division excel model has been added and you can generate up to 1000 images per day and you can also select different dimensions from here and you can also uh, give different seed and different sampler as well so you can also adjust the prompt guidance and quality and details and you can also give image to image so you can use image uh, reference for this uh, stable efficient excel and you can also add filters from here so you can see different filters like we seen in uh, clip drop so they are having different filters uh, and playground a have different filters so let's add the same prompt here and let's try to add filter let's try ultra lighting so you can remove exclude from image and you can see they are already giving some default 
exclude from image prompts so you can use that or you can remove that so if you want you can also use uh, image to image let's try without image to image let's click on generate so you can see the results let's try with four different images so we can uh, get more results so you can see the results with filter ultra lighting and with sampler p and dm these are the results let's try with the different sampler let's try with k euler ancestral and with filter let's try cinematic so you can see the results so let's try with uh, image to image so let's try to add a different image I have added this image to boats in a lake so let's try to give that in the prompt let's try to different filter let's try this filter wasteland and I'm gonna give the sampler as k euler ancestral so I'm gonna keep the exclude from image as empty click on generate so you can see the result so it is pretty much looking same so so this is how we can use uh, image to image and with prompt using stable diffusion excel model so if you like this uh, stable diffusion excel model please uh, share your thoughts on the comment section so thanks for watching so this is the way you can uh, use stable diffusion using playground ai and clip drop so there are different methods to use uh, stable diffusion so these are the two methods i covered in this video so thanks for watching if you like this video give thumbs up subscribe the channel for more future tutorials also press the bell icon so that you can get instant notification when i upload a video thanks for watching and bye